talked about it pregame. They have shown themselves this year to be a very dangerous club at times. Well, they were up 10 on Florida State with five minutes to go in the game, or six minutes to go in the game, and lost a tough game. And they're off to a good start as Justin Brown. Now it's fun to tip in at the buzzer to a good, I mean, a good quality Utah State team who really handled Nevada very easily last night. Nice stroke from the wing for Precious Achua. By Lomax. Good defensive play by Lomax the way it rotated over. Staying in front of Collins is very difficult. Nice little Lomax dish. with a nice shovel pass, and it's laid in on the reverse. Well done oh. by Malcolm Dandridge. Dandridge, though, can't defend the rim. Achua knocks it down. He's a big-time player. He's a prime type of... And they lost to Georgia in the game they played without Jeffries, who's their second-best all-around player. Nice oh, pick and nice roll. And hanging from the rim is Malcolm Dandridge. Pretty good. His former coach with the NBA Magic, which he had a bottle in the house, which he said the playoff game against Miami, he went for 41 and 42. Two forces more turnovers, as you said as well, than Memphis. So both teams want to take care of the basketball. And that a chew a foul on Collins after a Memphis giveaway. And then Collins. You can't factor in how important a guy like that would be. Oh, Tyler look at this. All oh, over. Well, you got to call it court. And you he takes it away and lands it in. Oh. You win, you can take the car or the cat. You got my book, by the way, autograph. Collins buries a triple. Tell you one thing you do. a three from the corner for Lester Quinone. Pearl's got to be up there, no question. So does Dutcher, and so does Laval Jordan down at Butler. has got to be in the mix. Durr slips to the goal. Now does a great job. Durr at the front of the rim, lays it in. Another terrific find from Zach Dawson. You're a terrific Yeah, player. Oscar Shibwe. Freshman, diaper dandy. Williams catches Memphis napping. A quick trigger off the inbound. Want to stay in front. You can't let him make the turn. Coach Gregory, diagram for us. See right there, that's a no-no. That causes trouble. Lomax that's to Achua. Goes in, help rotates over, open layup. Very simple, simplicity. Collins scoops oh, and scores. I like Collins. I mean, you're old, but you're not that old. Rideau with a no-look to Collins who swoops in oh, and lays it in again. What a big about 30, they scored 34 points. 34 points at the Carrier Dome against Virginia. They come back this past weekend and they beat, they beat Virginia. Rideau with a shot fake. And now Collins thought about an NBA three. Off the bounce. That's score pinned the by Achua. Score and the score basket. the basket, says Lamar Simpson. See. Look to attack. And here are some of the topics that you addressed. How about Baylor? You talked about not only a win at Kansas, but the first time ever. At, didn't and rushed good. that shot yeah, as Boogie good. Ellis. Ball movement to Harris. Old school floater is perfect for Tyler Harris. Well, you know, Michael Rusko, the commissioner, has done a great job at this conference. Mike used to work at ESPN. Was terrific at programming. I'm not shocked with his success. Look, two-man game. Lomax to Achua again, the pick and roll. You were talking about that, and not about his brick he just threw up. <laughs> <laughs> he said, what are you going to mention that for a brick, Dickie B? What are you going to do that? Zach Dawson banks it oh. in space, and it's tracked down by Xavier Castaneda. Yeah, Dawson was a big-time high school recruit. Decided to go to Oklahoma State. Please didn't pan out. Dawson rolls home a three. So they matched the shot clock to the game clock, took it down to six. That will explain. Hardaway. No good. Offensive rebound to Chua. What a rebound. No rotation. Forcing one up on the rim was Rideau. It's rebounded by Jeffries. Jeffries very talented. Very skilled. Quinones from the corner. Hit South Florida. But this league can disappear quickly. Dawson. Yes. He's trying to give him positive minutes. Zoni. Zoni. Let me see the full court pressure. There's a zone buster. Straight away three goes down for Zach Dawson. Not normally a zone team. He's trying to make a little jump for change. Don't no turn over the other. Max gets the steal. Quinones swoops in. Plus the foul. Nice pass. Good two-man break. And how they changed 
the fashion of basketball, the style of basketball, and how every kid growing up then wanted to be one of those guys. Well, and also, they were able to win in basketball. Pass deflected. Ball gave it right to Dirk. Which turnovers up to about 16? Dawson in transition finds Brown. That's oh, a very oh. triple once again. Back to that lead. That's the biggest lead they've had. 12. Collins with, with a steal. Oh, oh, he's in oh, and throws it down. Up, up and away. Look at him. The Bulls fans love what they see defensively as a freshman. Look at this. There he goes. Really good day. Tyler Harris, NBA range. Yes. He's really the Memphis. They had a heck of a team on that court, man. Harry Keenan and company. But it's too much. Missed the bill. There's a three from the big man. But taken right back. Oh, by nobody Lomax. back. And he nobody finds back. Harris. Cruises in for two. Nobody back. Defensive transition. Since that makes them a really dangerous team. Well, he's one of the most improved players. We'll see that, you and I, next week against Arkansas. But Musselman's done a great job with that team. That's one eye, four eyes. You know that. <laughs> Oh, nice slip release. to the goal for Achua. Open up space for him, angles for driving. You got a roof for Brian Gregory. He's such a super guy. Lomax with the scoop. That time, fingertips with Achua giving him a little shove in the back. Lomax attacks the rim again. This time, it's Jeffries to Achua. Yes. He's now on the side of Memphis. Shot clock down to five. Dawson, he's going to have to put one up. Got it. He won an overtime over Connecticut. Double overtime. Yeah. Lomax to Achua. Oh, finds nice Jeffries. Pass. Nice pass. Just take him off the floor again on the defensive end, which is where you'd want him to be. Absolutely. Achua seals inside, and he's got a chance to give Memphis their first lead since it was 17-16. Seth has gone about five minutes without a field goal. They've made one of their last eight. And he here's goes. Achua. Flying yeah. to the goal. Just talked about it. Just talked about it. About unbelievable situation. He stays calm. You don't see him screaming, yelling, going bananas when the team is down. It's for turning the ball over. It's not like they don't have a team that's gonna oh, got to make those free throws. They got them both. Six percent. Yeah, he's got the great stroke. And oh, there is the announcer. Oh, he gives him a chance. To come up, push that ball. He's got the second. Misses the first. One of two. Seconds to go. We have to think about an intentional miss. But he, by not executing in the last five minutes. That was an intentional yep. miss. Achua's got the rebound, and he's fouled with 4.4 to go. He's got it, and yeah. that will just about do it. Now no Memphis foul. just wants to stay away from USF with four seconds to go. Yeah, I really like Penny on that sideline. He has a great understanding of what's going on. Rideau tosses one up, and it's a comeback win for Memphis. They trailed at one point by 14, and they win it by four. Tough, tough loss. No question about it. Just a tough, tough loss for South Florida, and a terrific win for Memphis. Showing a lot of resiliency to come all the way back and win that game, Rob.